everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to Cook Like a Japanese Channel. I'm Ryo. Today we are making simple pork hot pot. You know the recipe is super simple, easy to make, so I believe it will be a good starter for you to try making various Japanese nabe dishes. You know, all you need is sliced pork berry, a Chinese cabbage, a stalk of green onion, and two cloves of garlic. It will be super yummy, so why don't you give it a try? Alright, let's get started! But the ingredients for simple pork hot pot are only four. Number one is pork belly. Today I have about 200 grams. Number two is Chinese cabbage. Today I will use one eighth card of it. Number three is a stalk of green onion. I use three quarters of it for ingredient and the rest of it is to be used to make the salt green onion sauce. Number four is two cloves of garlic. Plus you need a bit of salt and pepper to season the pork along with 600 cc of chicken soup stock. For the salt green onion sauce, you need a quarter stove of shredded green onion, a salt half teaspoon, chicken soup stock powder half teaspoon, lemon juice two tablespoons, sesame oil three tablespoons, and four tablespoons of water. Well, we got only five steps to make it. Step number one is to cut the ingredients. Cut the Chinese cabbage into bite-sized pieces. Cut the three quarters of green onion. Chop rest of it for the salt green onion sauce. Slice the two cloves of garlic. Cut the pork belly into bite-sized pieces and sprinkle some salt and pepper on it. Step number two is to make the chicken soup stock. I add in one teaspoon of chicken soup stock powder in 600 cc of water. Step number three is to make salt green onion sauce. Put the chopped green onion in a bowl, add in salt half teaspoon, chicken soup stock powder half teaspoon as well. Two tablespoon of lemon juice, plus you need three tablespoon of sesame oil, and full tablespoon of water. Give it a nice mix and set it aside. Set number four is to heat the ingredients. In another bowl, place a half amount of the cut Chinese cabbage, a half amount of pork belly, plus a half amount of sliced green onion. Do the same things again and make two layers in it. Pour in 600 cc of chicken soup stock, place the sliced garlic on it, put the lid on and heat it with medium heat first. When you bring it to a boil, turn down the heat into a low and keep heating it for about 10 minutes. The final step, step 5, is to add in the salt green onion soup and keep heating it for another 5 minutes. That is super easy, isn't it? So why don't we go on to step 1. Alright, what are we going to step number one? Step number one is to cut the ingredients. I already rinsed the uh, Chinese cabbage, so I cut it into bite-sized pieces like this. Yeah, I recommend you to cut stem part smaller, leaf part bigger. Okay, it's done. All right, what are we going to green onion stuff as well? Save one quarter for the uh, salt green onion sauce. So I slice less of it. First, I throw the outermost layer and slice it. It's sliced. Why don't we set it aside? Alright, shred the one quarter of green onion for the salt green onion sauce. Okay, shred it. Alright, what are we going to garlic stuff? Okay, peel the skin. Yeah, it's peeled. Slice it. It's sliced. So what are we going to pork belly stuff? Slice them in bite-sized pieces. Why don't you cut it in bite-sized pieces? Alright, it's the end of step one. At the end of step one, why don't we put some salt and pepper on the sliced pork? Okay, it's end of step one. Why don't we go on to step two? Step two is to make chicken soup stock. I add in one teaspoon of chicken soup stock powder and add in 600 cc of water. Okay, it's done. Set it aside. All right, what are we going to step three? 
Step three is to make salt green onion sauce. I add in the uh, chopped green onion, add in half teaspoon of salt, half teaspoon of chicken soup stock powder, plus two tablespoons of lemon juice. It's one tablespoon, another tablespoon of lemon juice. Yeah, flavor is awesome. Okay. Plus you need three tablespoons of sesame oil. One, two, three tablespoons. Oh, that's it. And the flavor is awesome. Yeah, that looks nice. Plus four tablespoons of water. And give it a nice mix. Put it aside. Alright, what are we going to step four? Step four is to heat the ingredients. First, put a half of Chinese cabbage in another bowl like this. Yeah, I believe it's about a half. So, put half of the cup pork belly on it. Yeah, I believe it's about a half. Half, okay. And put half of green onion on it. Put a half green onion. Do the same thing again. Another half of cut Chinese. Cabbage. Okay, it's done. So, put the uh, pork belly, rest of pork belly, like this. It's more than half, but it's okay. Yeah, it looks beautiful. So, why don't you put the uh, green onion stuff, plus put the uh, sliced garlic in it, and pour the chicken soup stock, 6 and the cc. Right, turn on heat, medium heat, and bring it to a boil. Well, no, I brought my dab got boil, so why don't we turn down heat in the low and keep heating it for 10 minutes. Right now, 10 minutes has passed, so why don't we go on to final step. Okay, looks awesome, isn't it? Okay, 10 minutes has passed, so why don't we add in the uh, salt garlic sauce in it. Wow, great. When you add in the uh, salt garlic sauce, put the lid back on. <laughs> and heat it for another five minutes that's the step five all right now another five minutes has passed so why don't we open the nabe wow that's great it's ready to go you know it's finished it's done okay looks awesome isn't it all right now you know to make simple pork hot pot is quite easy right so why don't you give it a try at your home anyway thanks for watching and if you like this video put thumbs up button leave some messages and subscribe and thanks for watching see you in the next video take good care arigato bye see you